Hi, my darlings. This is Auntie Sarah's once again. Mm, Auntie Sarah is in a little bit sad mood today. Mm, the thing is that my nephew passed away, and we just have the prayers. But you know, in life, um, how to say, everything has to move on. We can't stay on one page, no? Correct, my darlings. Mm? Like we had a. Uh, Someone wise told, you know, there was a story that a mother just had delivered her child and the child passed away. And she was so heartbroken, so stressed and so sad. She cried and cried and she went and she found a, a, a baba, what is called like a, a high priest or someone like a wise man, let's say. Yeah? So she asked the wise man, Wise man, please help me. Please, this is my only child. I just had him for a few hours in my hand. And he passed away. He left me. So she was so sad. The wife, Please make him alive again. Please make him alive again. Um, she kept on crying in pain. So the wise man told her, Okay, I will help you. You must go to any house and take one handful of rice and give him then she was about to run and say okay i'll bring the rice so you can make my son alive again she said he said the wise man said with one condition yeah the house has to have no debt that means the house cannot have any debt you have to bring that rice from that house and then uh, he will help so she went running to the nearest house hi can you please give me a, a, a handful of rice I need it to make my son alive the a man answered the, call, the door he said I'm sorry I can't help you because my wife just passed away so she ran to the next house hi can you please give me a handful of rice but the thing is that no one can be dead in, there's no death in your family or something like that so the old lady answered. She said, oh, my husband passed away. So she ran to the next door and next and next. Every house there was someone who actually passed away. You know? So it's showing that it's inevitable. She finally understood that this is something that God has gave her. You know? Um, it's not a bad thing. It's not a good thing. We should think is that that is, of course, very saddening. But we have to be strong. We have to take it positive and must remember that the soul of the other person will definitely be going to a better place. You know? So, okay, darlings. Um, Auntie Saras loves you. Take care of yourself. And, you know, do me a favor. Go and have a hug, a very big hug for your father or mother or your loved one anyone who's close to you just do me a big favor and go and hug them very closely okay auntie saras loves you take care see you in my next episode darlings bye